Hello guys, welcome to your first Perl tutorial. So in this first tutorial, we're actually going to download and install Perl. So we're going to bring up our browser and we're going to search for Active Perl Download. So that's going to pop up and the second one down right here, we've got activestate.com forward slash Active Perl. The third one down is the downloads page. So we're going to click on that and bring it up. So as you can see, if you scroll down a little bit, it has a list here of all the different platforms. So you should click the pick the platform that is relevant to you. I'm running a Windows 7 64-bit, so I'm going to click the installer for that. That brings up our installer here, and we're going to save that file. Okay, guys, once that downloads, we can bring up our installer, which I've got here on the desktop. So we're just going to double-click on this installer and click and it brings up the Microsoft installer we're just going to click next we want to agree to the license terms click next it asks a couple things to install we're going to install all of them click next again then it asks you three things we're going to keep all of these and we're going to click next and we're going to click install now depending on your machine this could take a few seconds mine's 64 bits so it should be pretty fast but I might speed this up anyway. And that has installed nicely, so it's asking you do you want to see the release notes? We'll just bring those up by clicking finish. Okay, so that's Perl installed. In the next tutorial, I'm going to show you how to test your Perl installation. Uh, I'm going to talk about text editors, IDEs, and we're going to write our first Perl script. So uh, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.